Well, I feel very good right now. I feel very confident in myself after the last games that I played. I say games because two happened and they were quick. Two games were very, very solid in terms of the offensive performance. I faced 99 Randy Johnson, the no-hitter version, and somehow did all right. That's very surprising for my standards of I that I think of myself. So what do you do now when you go into a game after you had such a good offensive performance? You leave everything the way it is. There's nobody that's leaving. There's nobody that's added hell. Everyone is already still on the field from the previous game. It's been so recent. Eddie Matthews is the only person who I have not been able to do anything with. That is no surprise. It's very cold. It's cold. It's wet. It's damp. My lips are very dry. The bliss X that I have is expired. Does that work? I'm scared to death to put old bliss X on my lips. Turn into a raspberry if I do. I gained, I don't know how this makes any sense. I won two games in the last, the last sitting. Only went up like 60 points or something. I, I lost 60 points just from one game. People quit out in like the third and fourth inning or something. So like, does the game understand that it was shorter so they don't give you as much or something? Best part about getting quick wins is that the pitchers get the stamina back. Dylan Cease is here today. After what seemed like he was just on the mound, he is back. He also had 99 Jimmy Fox. Everyone is, oh my. Why is his team name even more scary now? This is insane, this is not right. This is not right to do to somebody. How does that back him off the plate? I don't even care what division you're in. If you can win 25 games out of 26, you know what's going on. I am so scared to throw anything, I'm scared, I'm terrified. Oh, hold on. Maybe he is... He, maybe he's scared. No, no. Did it land yet? Ah! Ah! Rank has turned into BR at this point, it seems like. You face someone who's incredible one game, and then the next, it's someone who hasn't played the game before. All right, if Dylan Cease can't get it done, then I don't know what chance I have against anybody like this. Ah! And now Jimmy's up. You do in a game like this is you just try to minimize every sort of anything. Can you get easy outs, luckily? No way, that was nice. That was good. How do you know how you get that in the air? Are we doing this? All pitches he misses. I don't even care. Just catch it. As long as this doesn't leave, this works. Jeez, that was a lot closer than it should have been. Well, it's kind of unfortunate now because the one run per inning rule is already gone. That's what you have to do. That's what you have to do to tell yourself this might work. That's the only motivation you can have. There is no way he turned on that. That is so impressive. All right, well, now I just realize that every pitcher might be bad. I don't know how that works. Well, that was bad. That's not that bad. Yeah, it's not that bad. That's fine. If he had like 99 Randy Johnson or something, this would be terrible. But I'm either in for a sweat fest or this can get ugly. That one's got a chance. What? This needs to be an inning where he scores nothing. He can't score until at least the fifth at this point. If I want a chance. I don't look that dumb now. I stink. Boy, in a game like this, you sure would like somebody to show up to the field who isn't expected to. I need everybody. Oh, wait a second. All I need is a little bit of confidence, and then I'm in business. You either locate this or you hang it low, and it's always hit hard. Just missed. He walked him on four pitches. I don't think he really wanted to pitch 
Great. That's what you want to do is put people on base so he has a larger chance of taking a larger lead when he hits a home run. No! I don't know if there's a chance in hell I get out of this. I am I don't know what to do. All right, come on here. At least at least if you know you don't really have a chance, at least do something. At least do something that you know you don't feel so bad about. Jesus Christ, man! Wow. I think it is time. You know what's bad when the game wants you to take your starter out? It's not even halfway through the game yet. The question now is is who can get out? Oh wait, it's the third inning. Not even the fourth. It's the third inning, and the game suggested me to take the starter out. This guy took his starter out. Swing and a ball ripped out towards right center field. That'll touch down for a hit. Swings through that one. It's a strikeout. And one away. Now here's the switch. I don't know. Why can't he swing like that every other at bat? Sharp grounder. That's through. This is might, this might end this inning. This might not go further than the fourth. George Brett is going. Let's not pretend like we don't know. That counts. Hack it about! Really? I was beating people like this in BR. I was. I don't know how that happened, but I, I was. I was playing amazing people in BR and somehow winning. I swing it, you might run that out. Nice hit. Ripkin? I have no idea what pitchers can and can't do anything. I swear the first time I used Lopez, it was like the worst, one of the worst. It may have been a little bit worse than the inning I just had with Cease in the first one. And now he's getting out. Do I stand a chance is the question here. We're already halfway through the game and it's 7-1. The longer this goes on and I don't score, this, is, this will be over sooner. Right? I don't believe my eyes. Eddie Matthews. Eddie's walking around like Paul Heyman. It's 7 2. Good. Makes the turn and heads for second. And he's in with a stand up double. Everything good. The hell is brought in Bob Gibson. the bases and they add to their lead oh now this one's high and deep way back there on its way gone hit hard on the ground is short gal gets it over to first and that'll do Ladies it and gentlemen please join us for the traditional up the middle 
That's a base hit. So a man on base to start the inning. I don't know what to say. Up the middle. The feed for one. On the first double play, and that's the inning. How is this still going? Why is this game taking so long? This has been over since the first. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there, on its way. Gone. He leaves the yard to right. I don't like a child yelling in my backyard. Can't tell you how close I am to... Just giving up a home run. I am significantly debating on just throwing him fastballs down the middle until this is uh, within 10 runs. The sooner this is over, the better. I was thinking I was going into this game with a little bit of confidence after the last performance. Boy, did this have other plans. You can't throw anything up. You can't throw anything in. You can't throw anything outside. You can't throw anything low. So I guess you just have to kind of... Well, how does the mercy rule work if he scores another run in the top of the ninth? Because the point of being the home team is, is you get to possibly avoid it by batting. Do they let you bat in the ninth? Or wait, I'm, I'm stupid. Can't believe. This is gonna go all the way to the ninth for it to end that way. Instead of this ending at a good moment, we wait till the ninth. This could have been over in the fourth. Hit well, right field, way back and gone. He sends it out of here. Slow roller to first. Moose takes it himself, one away. And hit her weights. And he grounds one to the right side. Wagner collects. Now the throw to first on the run. On the ground to third. In plenty of time. Reynolds settles underneath it. Reynolds reaching back towards the wall. And there's two down. In the air out towards right center. Junior on the move to the alley. And that'll do it. And your final 12-2 for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. I'm John...